the rules there. Yeah, you know, Tina, earlier on we were in Rancho Cordova and there weren't as many vendors as there are here at the Midtown Farmers Market on 20th and K. And check this out. This is going to become the new norm here. You're going to see a hand washing table area for people to come on out here, wash their hands as they're shopping. And I've seen a lot of vendors. Actually, one was flashing his, uh, his Purell here at me. So they are taking extra precautions here this morning. Um, and especially the social distancing, right? So you're you're keeping people, you know, far away <laughs> to make sure you're safe and you have gloves here with you. Um, got gloves and everybody's got hand sanitizer. We're taking all the right precautions and only letting certain amount of people come up to the booth each time. Okay. So yeah, we're all dialed in. All right. Yeah. Well, thank you so much. Stay safe. Okay. Stay healthy. Um, we'll see you out here. <laughs> okay. We'll see you out there as well. Um, but there is food out here. Um, and here's the thing: a lot of people have been saying that they've been walking into supermarkets where it's been um, a little bit, you know. Uh, a little bit empty. There's not a lot of things out there. And one thing that I've noticed that's missing is bread. So I wanted to come over here to you, sir. So when I was at the store the other day, I couldn't find any bread. So you're out here. You're a local vendor. Um, Davis from Davis for 33 years, the okay. Upper Crust Baking Company. Fresh, no preservatives. It's great. Yeah, so so far, I mean, you guys have only been open for a few minutes, but um, you've seen people coming out here. How has the foot traffic been so far? A little slow. It's always slow at first thing in the morning here. Okay. It doesn't pick up to like 10 or 11 o'clock. I've noticed that over the last nine years I've been here. But yeah, it's. But I've had customers already, so it's been it's been really good. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and it's kind of good to see that the foot traffic is a little bit slow as yeah. well, because you don't want too many people to come yeah. on out here and be no, together. But it's nice seeing people, though. It's really good because right. I mean, since I've been doing, I've been here at this bakery at this spot for like nine years. Uh -huh. I know a lot of the people. I know a lot of the regular customers who come by every week to buy the bread, buy yeah. the cookies, and all that. And so, they're so. still coming. So. Oh, yeah, yeah, which is really good. <laughs> yeah, but we want to make sure, though, that we do reiterate, do not come out of the house unless you really, really have to. So unless you have to stock your, your items, you know, if you have to stock bread, if you have to stock, you know, your, your vegetables and you want to support local, this is the place to do it. But again, just make sure that you're doing it because it's essential for you and for your family at this time. But ladies, I'm going to toss it back to you because this is the, a great opportunity to restock my fridge. Instead yeah. of going there to the mayhem. It's nice <laughs> to see work. that they have right. a lot of bread there, too. Yeah. All right, very good. Thank you.